If you have an LG V20 H918 on the T-Mobile network and it suddenly starts popping up with this message that says unfortunately LG IMS has stopped and every time you close this message it pops back up a few seconds later this is a possible fix. I had three different phones in the family do this today at various times and what I ended up doing to correct the situation as I went into settings general apps and notifications app info and you go up to the top right hand corner and choose show system that's your system apps scroll down and find this one right here that says com lge ims rcs provider click on it force stop hit ok under storage clear the cache and clear the data hit ok go back to your app list Scroll on down and find the one that says LG IMS. Do the same thing. Force stop. Hit OK. Storage. I could only clear cache on this one. Go back. Scroll on down go to your messaging app for stop hit OK under storage go ahead and clear the cache and clear data hit OK don't worry this won't delete any of your messages it's just clearing the cache and the data from the app go back at this point on a couple of the phones I had to go all the way back up here to the one that says com LGE IMS RCS provider and I had to force it stop and storage and clear the cache and clear the data several times also you may need to reboot the phone but once you do that a few times, uh, clearing the cache and the data, the message should, should quit popping up. Now, I don't know why this occurred, but it happened on three different phones tonight or today at various times. One started early this morning, lasted for hours. We tried rebooting, pulling the battery out of the phone, everything you could possibly think of. It wasn't until those three apps were um, purged of the cache and the data that it um, corrected it on the first phone. The second phone started probably uh, six or eight hours later and doing the same three things corrected that phone and on my phone right here same thing happened just a few hours ago out of nowhere and the same three apps clearing the cache and or the data finally corrected its problem. But I hope this helps somebody. It's very frustrating, don't know why it's occurring, um, but it just happens out of the blue. It's the first time it's ever happened and all three phones and the family started happening today. Anyway, hope this helps somebody. Thank you.